Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. In a significant development in European defense cooperation, the Netherlands, Denmark, and Sweden have joined forces to manufacture CV-90 infantry fighting vehicles, IFVs, for Ukraine. As reported by the Dutch news website NAS on June 7, 2024, this initiative is backed by an allocation of 400 million euros to a Swedish fund dedicated to producing these Swedish-designed vehicles, marking a substantial commitment to bolstering Ukraine's defense capabilities amid ongoing conflict. Sweden has already made notable contributions, delivering 50 CV-90 IFVs to Ukraine as part of a comprehensive military aid package that also included Archer artillery systems. These vehicles, primarily the CV-9040 variant, have already been deployed on the battlefield in regions such as Donetsk. The CV-9040 is equipped with a 40mm Bofors L-70 autocannon, offering high firepower effective against both ground and air targets, alongside advanced fire control systems for enhanced accuracy. Its versatility is further boosted by the capability to equip a coaxial machine gun and anti-tank guided missiles. In addition to firepower, the CV-9040 is designed with robust armor to protect against small arms fire, shell splinters, and other battlefield threats. Its advanced mobility system, featuring a powerful engine and sophisticated suspension, ensures it can navigate challenging terrains with ease. This combination of firepower, protection, and mobility makes the CV-9040 a formidable asset in modern mechanized infantry operations. The collaboration extends beyond just the Netherlands and Sweden. On December 18, 2023, the defense ministers of Sweden and Denmark signed a joint declaration to send more CV-90S to Ukraine, with Denmark committing DKK 1.8 billion, approximately $264 million, to this effort. This trilateral cooperation underscores the growing solidarity among European nations in support of Ukraine's defense needs. Since Russia's invasion of Ukraine in February 2022, the Netherlands has been a pivotal supporter of Ukraine, providing extensive military and humanitarian aid. The Dutch government has delivered over 2.63 billion euros in military assistance, which includes weapons, training, equipment, and other supplies essential for the Ukrainian armed forces. In 2023 alone, the Netherlands pledged 2.5 billion euros in aid, with nearly 2 billion euros allocated for military assistance. For 2024, an additional 1 billion euros was committed, bringing the total to 3 billion euros, with another 3 billion euros earmarked for 2025. The Netherlands has supplied Ukraine with a wide array of combat vehicles and weapons. Highlights include the delivery of surface-to-air missile systems, such as two Patriot launchers and missiles in April 2023, with additional missiles pledged later that year. They also provided 12 AIM-120 AMROMs for NASAMS-2, 100 MR-2 mobile anti-aircraft guns purchased from Czechia, and 20 Bofors 40L-70S, which began arriving in March 2023. In terms of self-propelled artillery, the Netherlands supplied eight 155mm PZH-2000s in April 2022, with training completed by May and the artillery arriving in Ukraine from June 2022. An additional nine 155mm DITA self-propelled guns were announced in February 2024. For tanks, the Netherlands began delivering 45T-72 Avengers from December 2022, purchased from the Czech company Excalibur Army, and upgraded for delivery to Ukraine. They also pledged 33 out of over 100 Leopard 1A5S and 7 out of 14 Leopard 2A4S, in cooperation with Germany and Denmark. The Netherlands' contributions extend to armored fighting vehicles, with deliveries of Fenix in February 2023, over 196 YPR 765s from May 2022 onwards, 28 Ban von BVS 10s before March 2023, and 40M113 APCs with remote weapon stations as part of a joint donation with Belgium and Luxembourg. Engineering support has also been significant, with deliveries including a Scanjack 3500 mine clearing system, three Bozina mine clearing systems, six mine rollers for BMP IFVs, nine mine plows, five Bruckenlegepanzer B-Bear bridge layers, six M3 amphibious bridging vehicles, 24 Bailey bridges, and 1,000 portable mine clearing charges from 2023 onwards. The extensive aid package includes a total of 909 vehicles, featuring around 300 DAF YA 4442 and DAF YAZ 2300 trucks from November 2022 onwards, various ambulances, SUVs, lifting cranes, loaders, forklifts, side loaders, motorcycles, and six Toyota Land Cruiser ambulances. 
Furthermore, for heavy mortars, six 120mm MO120 HBs were delivered in November 2022. In the category of man-portable air defense systems, manpads, the Netherlands supplied 50 FIM-92 Stinger launchers from March 2022 onwards and 200 Stinger missiles in April 2022. This extensive and ongoing support from the Netherlands, in collaboration with Denmark and Sweden, highlights the significant international efforts to strengthen Ukraine's defense capabilities amid its conflict with Russia. The manufacture and delivery of CV-90 IFVs, among other military aids, underscore a collective commitment to ensuring Ukraine's sovereignty and security. That's all for now. See you later.